everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I'm Lauren. I have a very exciting video today because I think I might be unboxing my dream handbag. And I know that is a very bold statement to make. However, when I saw this online, I have not seen this in person. This is a fairly new release. There is a version out similar to this one, but I this one itself is a new release. So I have not seen it in person, but when I saw it online, it just made me feel a certain way and I had to get it. And typically I'm very thoughtful about my purchases, especially when it's one that's fairly expensive. Um, I'm not an impulse buyer, but I added it to my cart. I thought about it for about an hour and I couldn't stop thinking about it, so I bought it. So this is my Christmas slash birthday present because my birthday is coming up in December. So. I'm really excited to open this up and I know I have so many handbags and I do not need another handbag. I'm actually going to be gifting some to my friends and my family this year from my collection, some of the new ones that I picked up. So, and I also do have a gift that will be given to one of you. Um, just it's in an upcoming video, but, um, I know I didn't need another handbag. However, like I said, when I saw this, it really like it hit me differently and I, thought this is a forever piece in my collection. I bought this off of Matches. They were one of the only places other than the official site that had this one. So like I mentioned, because it is so new. So I'm really excited. It came to me, it's the weekend, it's Saturday, but I got this on Tuesday and I have not opened it up. Here we go, let's open this up together. I am so excited. I feel like my heart's beating really fast because I want this to work out so badly and I don't want to jinx myself. So here we go. Here we go. Let's open it up together. That is just the receipt. And then here it is. There's no box, which I guess that's probably typical when you order from matches. I'm trying to think. Yeah, unless you order it from the brand site. So I'm just going to pull it out of the paper here. In case I do need to return it, which again, fingers crossed, I just always like to make sure, oh, is there no dust bag? No, maybe the dust bag's inside. The dust bag must be inside. They wouldn't just give me this bag. Um, here it is. You can kind of tell it is a little bit of a bigger bag. Let's open this up. Okay. <laughs> this beautiful Loewe leather there. And then there's like a little protective piece. There's a weird, there's a protective piece on one side. So this is the bracelet bag, but in a shoulder bag version. So please let there be a dust bag on the inside. Okay, there's a dust bag on the inside. All right. Okay, okay. So here is the strap. The strap is the guitar style. So I think the original one came with the leather strap or there's a chain strap version of it but this one came with a guitar strap. This one also has the silver hardware, if you can see it. Um, and you know that I love, just make sure that the leather is good. I love silver hardware on my handbags. In general, I like gold hardware or gold jewelry. I am wearing silver today. I tried to kind of mix it up. This one actually has, if you can see, it has some gold tone here. It's supposed to be, worn kind of like this, but I don't like it with this little tail. I'm going to actually take this part off. So I'm just wearing it as a chain, but this is silver. I decided to kind of mix it up a little bit today, but okay. <laughs> so like I mentioned, this is called the bracelet, but the shoulder bag. So it is bigger. Here is the actual dust bag inside. And then it comes with whoop, the, um, authenticity, everything else. And then this is it. So it's very, Smushy. I don't think you can wear this one like the actual um, bracelet pouch. Loewe Adagram there. And then again, the silver hardware. And then the guitar strap here with the silver hardware as well. So I'm gonna attach the strap now. So you're either a fan of this guitar strap or you're not. But what I thought I could do is because I have my black Loewe here, with the silver hardware, if I didn't want to use the guitar strap, now I have an, another strap to use. 
and it matches totally fine. And I'm super excited because I can also use this guitar strap with my actual puzzle bag here. So if I want to switch it up, so now I have like a separate strap that I can use. And these Anagram guitar straps from the Weve are also fairly expensive. I think they sell for about $900 for one of these. And I like this one because it is all black. As you can kind of see, it just says Le Weve there. So you can see what it looks like. But this one, like I mentioned, is bigger. And I don't have a duffel bag like this. I have my Louis Vuitton Speedy 25, but if you follow my channel, then you know that I don't use this. But this one, it is so cute. I'm gonna include some modeling shots for you, but this, like when I saw it, it just totally caught my eye because it's very different. Like I said, it has this beautiful lambskin. I, let me, I think it's lambskin. Let me double check really quickly for you. The actual name for this is the Large Bracelet Pouch in Pleated Napa. Comes in two colors. Actually, on the mattress site, there was another color. Oh yeah, here it is. So it either comes in a beautiful tan color, it also comes in a green, as well as um, the black. It is Napa Lapskin. And it says it has the tonal, like, jacquard, I think that's how you pronounce it, strap, with leather plaques on the end. Oh, I didn't even notice this. Oh my goodness. So you can see there, the actual strap has the Loewe anagram there, which is so cool. I don't know if the, only one side has it. So there's leather, as you can kind of see, it says Loewe there. And then this side has that um, leather anagram um, detailing there that's I like that that is pretty cool um, anything else I will leave this down below in case you are interested so you can see it there but I just think it's so cool so from there I mean I'm getting at a loss for words because I'm really excited from the front or from the side you can't really tell you know what brand it is you can only tell here but I also feel like it's pretty discreet because it is um, debossed leather on either side. And then the strap, you know, it does say Loewe, but because it is in black too, you can't really notice it, right? So this is very much up my alley and I'm so excited to try this out. Now, my biggest concern was the fact that when it's empty, I think it's pretty soft. So as you can see it here, it's empty right now and it's pretty soft, but I do like bags that are softer that can kind of mold to the body. If you wanted to, you could definitely put a base shaper in here. I actually might get one. This is fairly light, I would say, because it is leather. It is lined, so it does have the traditional canvas lining. There isn't any pockets or anything on the inside. It's just sort of one open sack like that, but, um, I am, I'm gonna have to see what it's like when I put some items in. I'll do that when I do the try on so you can kind of see if it slouches a little bit, but I just think it is so stunning. And um, this is definitely, like I said, just a piece that I know I'm gonna have for such a long time. Now there is like a tiny, you can see it, there's a tiny little scuff here. Here is what it looks like. I do have my Lululemon Go Getter pouch in there, so it is providing a little bit of structure, but you can see the size of it on it just it's so comfortable to wear um i would either wear it i think on my shoulder like this or um as a cross body but i think it looks really cool on the shoulder it's super comfortable again it's really lightweight here it is as a cross body again i love it it is just so cool i love the look of the pleated leather and again with the anagram there but it's really comfortable again i do have my lululemon um pouch in there but it's just it is such a cool handbag and it's not too big for my frame. So I'm about 5'4 and 116 pounds and I feel like it is a good size. And again, I have all my essentials in here right now. If you were to wear it on your shoulder, it would kind of look like this. And again, I just have my items sort of free in there. However, my Lululemon, sorry, Bean is running around here. <laughs> she wants to get the tissue paper. Um, however, with my Lululemon go-getter pouch, it offers a little bit of shape, I would say. So 
I checked to see if my speedy base shaper would fit in there, but it doesn't. So again, here is that Lulu lemon pouch and it just, it slides right in. And now you have a little bit more shape as you can kind of see. So, I mean, I really like it. I think it's really cool. Is it for everybody? No. Would I say that this could be an everyday handbag? Um, like my Loewe puzzle? I don't think so. This one is not as delicate. This one, because it has a little bit more structure, it's just, I think, easier to wear and easier to carry. Whereas this one here, it's still super cool, but because it is that sort of Napa lab skin and because it also has this really smooth logo there, you have to be a bit more delicate with it. I did notice that there was a small little mark on the leather there. You might be able to see it, but I did take my finger and kind of buff it out. But again, you'd have to be a little bit more careful with this leather part here. I know that the people that have the metal, or sorry, the bracelet version that has a the metal, they also have to be a little bit more careful that it doesn't scratch. So you'd have to be, I mean, you'd have to take the same precaution with this sort of leather here because it is so beautiful and smooth that that logo, but all in all, I think it is just a stunning handbag. I'm very excited to have it in my collection. Like I said, I love the silver hardware. I love the strap with the anagram logo there. And again, with this guitar strap here, being able to interchange it. Let me actually try my Loewe strap on this one and see how it changes it up. Well, here it is with my Loewe puzzle strap on. The exact same leather and because it's the silver hardware it matches perfectly. You could definitely do this option too. I think it makes it a little bit dressier. The original um, bracelet pouch has either like I mentioned the chain strap or a leather strap like this so um, I do like that I have this option and I also like that I'm now able to take this one and put it on my puzzle I know that some of the puzzle bags have the guitar strap on it and I like the look of that it kind of gives it that sportier sort of feel so now I have an extra strap so kind of like a two for one if you do the girl math again, right? So very excited. I think it's just, that looks super cool too because it is a silver. And then that has, now it has that black strap. I mean, that's awesome. I'm so happy with this handbag. Let me know your thoughts on it. What do you think about this bracelet style? Um, I know that the first version wasn't for everybody. I would never have wear it the bracelet way. This one I don't think you can and it's so big that if you wore it as a bracelet, it would kind of be comical, but I think as a shoulder bag and as a cool pleated duffel, I mean, it's just, it's really innovative. And I think that Loewe did a really good job with this. So let me know your thoughts on this. What do you think about it? Um, would you be picking one up? Like I said, I will link it down below. And thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.